Hey guys, what's up? We're doing kind of like a new thing on the channel uh, where we review tools. This one's going to be a little bit different. I kind of wanted to tell you about the Spidia compressor I've been using. And uh, I primar primarily bought it to blow the lines out of my IV. This is what I use to blow the lines, the ear lines, out at the end of the season when I have to winterize my RV. And um, I'm going to bring you in, show you what it's all about, get a little closer to it, and um, kind of describe what I do with it and show you how it works. It's pretty inexpensive. So the air compressor, it's a three-gallon air compressor. It has a half a horsepower motor on it. Um, it came, I believe it came with this, yeah, it came, came with this hose on it. I've had it for a couple of years. And... Um, it has a regulator right here so you can adjust like the pressure coming out and that's what I do when I'm blowing out the lines in my RV so when I'm doing that um, I've got this check on the end of it for inflating ties but on my RV what I have is I have like a little adapter that goes into the water inlet and it screws in uh, I think I got it on Amazon and it has a little valve like a bicycle tire valve or a tire valve sticking out I can press this onto it, and um, I bring the, the PSI down to, I think it's, it's pretty low. It's like 25 or so, just enough to blow the lines out, and uh, you don't have to worry about breasting a line with the air, but it works great for that. Uh, this is a good air compressor for, like, inflating tires, like uh, pool floats and stuff like that. It's kind of like a light-duty compressor, obviously, but if you had, like, a, uh, if, a, if you had to rescue somebody who had, like, a slow leak in their tire, you can plug this thing in and put some air in it go out inflate the tire on the spot and hopefully get them to a, a tire you know store or back to your house whatever you need to do it's not that heavy there's a handle up on the top and you can kind of lump it around the on off switch is right here and um it just plugs into a regular 120 household current it's kind of loud i'm not gonna lie. <laughs> i'm not gonna lie to you but uh, i can turn it on real quick just to show you It's a little loud, but after probably like 40 to 60 seconds of being plugged in, it starts to build some pressure up, as you can see on the dial. But if you needed like a little compressor just to bang around with, I mean, I, I don't use this one too much. Um, but for what I use it for, it seems to work well. And, um, you know, I, I probably usually just kind of use it to blow up the lines of my trailers, like I said. But I just kind of wanted to show you what it looked like and how it functioned and the... And the you know how loud it was and stuff like that but uh if it's something you might need for once in a while like i do it's a it definitely is a great little compressor uh for what i use it for which is my rv if you guys have any questions um if you want to look drop a comment ask me about it i don't mind replying back and uh even if it's just a hey you know how is the compressor holding up do you still have it and stuff like that just to pick my brain just drop a comment on the video i'll reply back to you thanks for watching guys